Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Non-league to Premier League time. Two games today. Um, Millwall away and Wolves at home in the FA Cup. Fourth round. Now, we haven't won since. We've played about four or five league games. We haven't won, but we've picked up a couple of positive results in the last two games. Hopefully, that is turning the corner for us. We've also got our Bosnian wonder kid. Now, I did say in the last episode that we were going to see him in a year's time. I completely got my dates wrong. He joined on the 1st of January. He has found it tough, but I think he will come good. Right, right, let's get into it. Make sure you hit that subscribe button for me. Like today's video. Let's get in. Non-league to Premier League. Let's see if we can turn the corner today. I'm the chap with the red scarf on. Going around singing we are York. We're City. Play pretty. That is our style of football. How charming. Just like the Minster. A pint of bitter and a slice from Ginster. Walking the walk. Talking the talk. And singing we are York. Climbing up the old Division 4. If you score some... Right. So here we are. Last episode was the Fleetwood Bournemouth games. We then got smashed by a very good Middlesbrough side. They absolutely killed us. Um, away 3-3 at Derby County. 1-0 down. 1-1. 2-1 up. 2-2. 3-2 up at half-time. Then they scored in the second half. A 1-1 draw away at Sheffield United. Disappointing because they are well down in the league. Boston at home in the FA Cup. We did play a second string side. Um, at home against Swansea, a decent side. 9 down to 10 men um, with Glendon getting sent off. Two-footed tackle. Kovacs going for a set piece. We deserved a point. And then we've just played Barnsley in the league and 1-1. But we kind of edged it. We looked good. We looked very good. We could have quite easily won it. So form has not been great in terms of results. We've not won in the league since the end of November. And now we are in the middle of January, so that's a little bit of a worry. Hopefully, we can get a win today. Millwall are quite a way down, 23rd, and then Wolves in the FA Cup. I would like a little FA Cup run. So we've done well to get a decent draw against Boston. If we can get decent draws, it'd be nice to get to a quarter final. Right. The league looks like this. We've got a game in hand, um, but we're now seven points off. We are now seven points off. So we've got a fair bit of catching up to do. Wins against teams like Millwall, who are well in the relegation. They're seven points adrift already. It's important that we get a win under our belt. That will give us 41, and then we're only four points adrift. And you never know if we can get rediscover a little bit of form. We may just sneak into the playoffs. The playoffs are very tight. The top four are only separated by three points. We've shown we've got the quality. We just need to pick it back up for these final what? What have we got? 19 games of tactic-wise. We did drop it into a 4-3-3 to start with, but I, I just think these two are probably our best our best players and we just need to go out and score goals. It's as simple as that. Um, we've, we're not pressing high no more. We're dropping back a little bit. So we're not, we're not pressing so high. Might just help us a little bit more defensively. Glendon's now injured. and He's injured and suspended. Chisholm's out. Um, but apart from that, Silver and Svan don't like playing with each other. So it'll be interesting to see how they get on together. Right, here we go. We need a victory. Let's see, there's Herich. There's Herich. Only three games he's played. Not not a great start. 6.67. Um, still only 17, though. I think, hopefully, he's going to turn into still turn into a beast. As I said, I don't quite see him as, as a Mazala because he hasn't got... <clears throat> He hasn't got great vision and great off the ball. I'm seeing him more as just a box, box to box. I won't be playing him that deep line playmaker role, I want the thought. I'm using him more for his physicality more than anything else. Right, here we go, boys. Come on, we need a win today. I said we're, we're probably only Glendon and Chisholm short have been full strength. I think what we are going to do is, if if we don't get playoffs this year, we're, we're really going to... I think we'll do it anyway. We'll really make a push. And if we've got the same amount of money again to spend, it's not like 15 million, then we're going to spend it, I think. We're going to really go for it. Um, offer more out on wages, get some real quality in. Premier League, good loanies. 1-0, what a run for Mahoney. What a run. Um, but yeah, we're going to go for it. I don't want the save to stagnate and go a little bit... A little bit stale. Playing in the championship season after season, we really want to kick on. Um, you know, this is only our second year, so we're not we're not in a great rush. But I don't want another season next year, depending on how we finish. If we finish 
a good number of points and places away from the playoffs, then I really want to give it a push. All right, Peters has picked up the loose ball, but Kovac is coming across brilliantly. Silva, he's found with Stretter in the channel. Get in there, Odo Benjo. Half cleared. They're going to have a go themselves. Can we get it back? Can we get it back? Good tackle from Hedic. Hedic. Kovac. It's gone long. with Stretter nods it down. Odo Becco is in. Finish. Finish. Oh. Outside. We've got two. We've got two strikers that are going to cause problems, but they do miss some bloody chances. Right, Svan. Odo Becco. Can he strip? He slipped in from Stretter. Who's going to slip in Svan? Maybe Svan. Great first half. Sorry, great 33 minutes. Not a first half yet. What a strike that was. Svan starting it. Nodded it down from the goal kick. Odo Becco into Mistretta. Down the line. Svan. That's what we want. All four players have been... All four of my attacking players have been involved in the two goals. I kind of thought, right, we're just going to drop back a little bit. Let them four be in the strongest position. So we've got two wingers. One as a presser as well. I didn't want to do two advanced forwards. I thought Odo Becco could do that presser. Sese can do it as well. So can Mistretta. Mahoney's in. It's 3-0. Odo Becco tees up Mahoney. He's got 10 for the season. 10 for the season. He's got his Wales cap finally. Brilliant first half performance. Right, same again, boys, please. So we did play well against Barnsley. We were unlucky not to get three points against them. Right, Raya. He's gone along. He's found Mahoney. We've lost out. Macbeth. He's now going through. Can we get a tackle in? They always look like I think we can break this low block that we've got. Look, here we go. Look, we can punish because it gives us space. Fans just run through. Oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. it does give us the opportunity to counter when we can. If they go along, we can win the headers. Get the ball down and play it. And we've had our wingers break in and just running there. Dropping off, dropping off, dropping off, dropping off. It just opened up for him. In he went. And that's a nice finish from Nilly Svan. He's back on it. I'm going to praise it. Oh, steer. Right, I'm on 63. I'm just going to look at some fitness. Uh, let's get Sese on on the left. Let's rest Mahoney. Right, 15 to go. We're going to take off. We're going to take off Herich. He's had a good game. And we're going to take off... Let's get Coutinho on. Coutinho, a deep line playmaker. Yes, please. Spread them balls about Philippe. Probably one of the worst buys ever. <laughs> of the... of the, well, he's, he's on 15 grand, isn't he? So he's gone at the end of the season, boys. Right, that's a brilliant result. Teases up nicely now. For Wolves. Oh, Joachim Lowe's been sacked at Liverpool. We need to... I would really like a cup run. Before we get big. You know, getting maybe to even a semi-final. But we're, we're way off that. It's only fourth round. So we've got to get through two rounds to get through to the quarters. Quarters would be nice. But Wolves, since we smashed them um, a couple of episodes ago, they've really picked up a fair bit of form. And now in the playoffs. We've just gone up to ninth. But it's opened up nicely. Wolves on 45. We've got a game in hand on them. We've got a game in hand on Hull. We've got a good goal difference. So, yeah. Fingers crossed. The next time you come back, we will have had a decent little run. Just get into the playoffs, innit? Get into the playoffs and you never, never know. Bit of transfer news for you. Ian, one of my patrons on the channel, he's never going to play in the first team. And I'm quite happy that a club has come in for him. Um, he wasn't transfer listed or anything. I'm going to make a parting comment to you, Ian. You've been a fantastic servant. <laughs> um, yeah, you don't look like that. You don't look like that, do you, Ian? But there you go. So, yeah, there's one another patron, unfortunately, out the door. But I'm pleased that he's going to stay in the game. We will have a look back every so often. Hey, up, oh, Everton. Been linked to Everton, boys. I've got Pinamonte. I couldn't care less. I couldn't care less. Hey. Right, unfortunately, Odebeko has picked up a virus and he's now been sent home for two weeks. So he's missing. They've got Koulibaly in. Theobald is still on the bench and has just played one game in the Carabao Cup. Um, so we've gone for Jamie Chisholm. 
who I think is our leading goal scorer. He's got 10 in, 10 from playing out wide as well. Um, only small, not going to have the physical presence, but he has a good eye for goal. Hopefully, he's going to rip Koulibaly a new one. They lost. They also they played midweek as well in the league, and they also lost to Wanded Wolves. So they're not in sparkling form. They've just slipped up last couple of games in the league. It's given us that opportunity to get back. We have got Nottingham Forest next. That's going to be tough. Right, Mahoney. Oh, block! Chisholm's there. Get in. Loving that one is Chisholm. Into Steer, into Herich. Steer, nice little touch. Mahoney, did he shoot? He shot, it was blocked. Oh, great goal from Chisholm. Reactions. Right, Steer. Got guys at the bar. Stick, Mistretta. Nodding it over. They've got Ronaldo Vieira as well. 28 million he's worth. Whew. We can only dream. Steer. Right, can we defend? Can we defend? Can we defend? Come on, Herich. Come on, Herich. Come on, Herich. He's absolutely doing you there. He's tried to block it. Half cleared. We're going to break his fan steer. Mistretta, brilliant touch. Is he going to slip it to his strike partner? Is he going to go himself? He's gone himself. Good counter again from us. Decent play by Svan as well. Right, Chisholm. Neat little touch. Mahoney. Just put it back. Put it back. No, he's going to go himself, I think. Clipped a lovely ball outside to Silver. Silver with it. Get in. 2 0. FA Cup, fourth round. We are smashing Wolves again at the community stadium. I nearly said Bootham Crescent, but we're not there anymore. Right. They're just going to get a little sniff before half time. This is what I mean. Every time they've got the ball at the moment, I think we can have the opportunity of scoring. Hedich has gone all the way through. Oh, I thought it might have just bobbled in. Great run from Herich, breaking up the play to start with. Mahoney's there. Reed, Herich. And it's Clay Vieira's there. The £30 million pound man is there. I have to praise it, boys. That was brilliant. Overwhelmed. How can you be overwhelmed from it? Silver, Herich. Ooh, Steer, nice. Silver, Chisholm's underneath it. He's only five foot nine. No, Steer, Mahoney, 3 0. A bit like the goal he scored in the last game, deceiving. Where? <laughs> what was that? What on earth was that? Right. Let's just. I will zoom in for you boys to see that a little bit better. Right, watch his celebration. Watch, watch, watch his legs. Ah, oh, he didn't do that. That didn't happen, did it? He didn't do that. I'll zoom in. I'll zoom in on it and show you it. 3 0 at half time. Absolutely bossing it. We'll do some subs as well. We've got Nottingham Forest in three days in the league, so it'd be good to get a couple of players rested. Right, Mahoney, start of the second half. Ooh, Hedix is there. Steer. Svan. Mistretta. What a start to the second half. Just like that, boys. It's just turned for us. We have got a very, very young side and the boys are doing as well. Mistretta, he's still only 20. Mahoney's young, Svan's young. Steer, 23. Um, Herich, 17. Aluknak, 25. Kovac, 22. Silver, he's on loan, 19, but I do want to get him in. Raya, brilliant, 32. I want to try and get some of these guys permanent. I'm not sure if Liverpool... To be fair, he's only worth two mil. I don't know, Liverpool. Are Liverpool gonna want to? Are Liverpool gonna want to play him? He's not gonna be playing for him next season, is he? He's only five. He says he can do a job at centre half, but he can't. Not a chance. Right, Steer. Need to get some subs on. Don't we? Five nil. Jason Reed. Bloody hell. Right, Mahoney off. Let's get Boom on. Let's fan off. Let's get. Let's put Sese on, but we'll put Sese up front. Chisholm can go out to the right. Let's get a third on. Spencer off. Let's get Philippe Coutinho on. York City 5, Wolves nil. Wolves do not like coming to York. Sell out again. 
Emre Chan's on the pitch, Shalabar's on the pitch, Jota's on the pitch, Sabitzer's on the pitch, and we are absolutely smashing them. Chisholm. Sese, get in. York City, six. Wolves nil. Lovely little cross. Stinks cross from Chisholm. Sese got a cross. Koulibaly, I think it is. He's beaten Koulibaly. Oh, well, he, he came across Koulibaly and then just pipped in front of Tapia. Look at the players they've got in there. And we have smashed them 4-6. Well, that's a little bit better than the last episode. Because I said the last episode depressed me a little bit. Um, and then the games in between depressed me a little bit. Right, boys. What a bloody performance that is. Should we do the draw? When have we got the draw? Is the draw coming up? It should be, shouldn't it? We'll do the draw before we finish. Everton job interview. Some money. <clears throat> Finance is okay. I'm not going, obviously. Pinamonte. I can't say his name, boys, but he's good, isn't he? Um, Sars there. We need to get in the Premier League. Decline it. But there we go. That's the level we're at now, boys. I don't think they're the first Premier League club to, to sniff me out, but definitely one of the big, big clubs. DL Mistretta. Is he any need for that? He scores a couple of goals, then he thinks he's fucking Billy Big Bollocks. Oh, God. Another one wanting a new contract. You've, he's, lit, he's literally been here like... Why? He's literally been here five minutes. Seven million, boys. Fucking go. Can't stand players, you know. I mean, he's not even been not even been here six months. Right. Draw. Don't want to get on the wrong side of me. Managing. Right. <clears throat> No. 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 Big one, that. Oh, Cheltenham. Cheltenham are still in it. We want Cheltenham or Barnsley and Swansea at home. I'd even take West Ham, Fulham at home. Tottenham. Ah. No, it's Swansea or Cheltenham. Fulham, West Ham. We've got Barnsley at home, please. Yes. Barnsley at home in the fifth round. There. We'll come back for it. We'll come back for Crystal Palace. We owe, we owe Crystal Palace one. We definitely owe them one. So, yeah, we'll come back. Barnsley, Crystal Palace in the FA Cup fifth round and in the league. We've got a couple of away games. We've got some bigs. They're all just big games. Bournemouth are up there. Uh, Leeds, Hull, Borough, QPR, Wednesday. All big boys. It's Nottingham Forest next who are fifth. Palace are third. Borough are second. Barnsley are top. Big, big games. The only diff the only easiest one is Huddersfield down. Easy easiest. Easier game out of the lot. Would hopefully you consider maybe but Huddersfield, but Christ, it's tight as well. We're only a point. We've got two games in hand, six points behind. So we need to get at least our spare games in hand. We do need to rack up some wins. Um and make sure we don't fall too far behind. And that's it for today, boys. Hope you enjoyed that. Much better. A little bit of positivity. Um, two fantastic wins. Next episode, as I said, will be Friday, uh, Thursday. Smash through, hopefully Crystal Palace. We owe Crystal Palace one. And they are, as I said, up in third. So that's going to be a big game. Barnsley in the FA Cup. They're top of the championship. Would love a cup run. Right. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Like, subscribe. Muchly appreciated. See you later.